now from flooding and droughts to sewage and plastic pollution. There are many issues facing our country's rivers. Now to try to tackle some of that, a river in Somerset has been reconnected to its original floodplain to help mitigate the impact of climate change. John Maguire has been to see the pioneering project. Our beautiful countryside has been shaped by centuries of agriculture with straightened rivers and regularly shaped fields. But here at the Hunnicutt Estate on the edge of Exmoor, and for the first time in the UK on this scale, the National Trust is turning back the clock, filling in a one kilometre stretch of the River Aller and allowing the water to find its own course across open land. This illustrates pretty well how the scheme works. This part of the river hasn't been changed. It's straight, the banks are quite deep, albeit not a lot of water in the river at the moment, but in winter it'll really fly through here as the water flows down. So let me show you what difference the new work has made. Where the channel has been filled in, the water's finding its own way, reconnecting the river with its floodplain, they say. Already, in only the four or six weeks since the work was completed, lots and lots of greenery and an abundance of wildlife. The project has been very, very successful. It's almost like a control alt delete reset of a river system, and this project really delivers on a broad range of benefits. So, um, it helps reduce flooding downstream. As you can see, it's really dry at the moment, but this site's really wet, so it holds water in the landscape. It sequesters carbon. As you can see today, it's amazing for wildlife. And hopefully over time, it'll help us engage people in nature as well. So I think with this type of river restoration, you get a lot of bang for your buck. This is what the site looked like last autumn. The wet summer has worked wonders ever since. The logs you can see mimic the dead wood that would be found naturally in a wetland environment. And one ambition is to allow the estate's wild beavers to inhabit this area. Early signs are showing immediate improvements to the local wildlife and the water's cleanliness. But the team here believes this, or versions of it, can help to reduce the biggest threat we face, climate change, a major cause that may be helped by allowing water to find its own course. John Maguire, BBC News.